People talk about the importance of effective communication, right? But what, is, what does that really mean? And one of the things it means to me is that when you have a problem with the organization, you need to bring that problem to someone who can solve it. If you are quiet about that problem uh, and, and you uh, let it fester and you're talking about it like to people that report to you or you're talking about it down the line, then what's happening? You're not being an agent of change and you're not taking that problem to somebody that you can deal with it, that somebody can deal with that problem. So I, I have a, uh, an old saying in business, which is don't live in a prison for which you hold the key. So a lot of people are really uh, you know, upset about a policy and maybe that policy can't change and you need to understand why that policy exists. But, uh, and I would give this advice to, to, to someone just starting out or someone that's been in management for a long time is uh, the only way to deal with a, a disagreement with management or a policy or something the corporation is doing is to escalate that situation and most people will not do that. Um, so I tell people try not to live in a prison for which you hold the key. Uh, you might not get the answer you want but you will get an answer um, and don't be afraid to escalate something to your direct supervisor um, because that supervisor is the person who's most likely going to either take your, your issue forward or explain to you why, uh, why your issue is, a, is on the back burner for right now. But don't be afraid to escalate a problem.